All right, this is one of the final pieces here. This is the crayon pole. I'm leaving the last video. I said it was the last one, but I forgot. We have two more pieces to make, two slides. Uh, these last three are the more difficult pieces to make. That's why I've saved them for later. Uh, this one's not too terribly difficult. You just have to dimension things in a certain order in order to make it easy. Uh, in fact, this is probably the fourth or fifth time I've started making this video because I've done it the hard way a couple times. So, uh, But I'm leaving this one blank when I finish it. You can color them uh, all different colors if you want when you put the crayon poles. Uh, these are basically going to keep kids from walking off the top of your playground when they get to the top of the ladder or top of the wall climb. It's kind of like a safety precaution here. So. That's why the edges are not pointy, they're more rounded. So this is an individual crayon. Uh, you can import bunches of them in the assembly and then color them. So we'll show you how to make this real quick here. iPro, new part, standard.ipt. We're going to make our sketch here in the X and Y plane. And we're going to just draw out the generic shape here. We're not going to put any dimensions in. Just draw you a line across the bottom, go straight up, come out just a little bit, make a diagonal line up, connect it back to the y-axis, and then back to the center point. So you should end up with something like that. Dimensions are not important right now. We could have typed them in as we went, but it would be really hard when we get to uh, the top of this. So just do it this way for right now. And then we're going to come up here and click Dimension. And now we have to dimension these la these sides last, or else everything will kind of get a little bit screwy. So let's dimension the bottom piece 1.5, one and a half inches. Okay, it's going to scoot everything over here a little bit. Let's dimension this top piece to be 0.3. And then let's dimension from this corner to right here to be 1.3. So you have something like that right there. The bottom piece, 1.5, okay, from this corner right here to this corner right here is 0.3, and from the corner of this line to here is 1.3, okay? Now to dimension the sides. This side over here, it's going to be 28 inches, 28, see how things get kind of screwy there, and then the right side is going to be 24 inches, so that you end up with something like that, really tall, with just a little indentation up here, and an angled line up here at the top. We'll finish that sketch, click on Revolve. Select this left side, and there is your crayon. We'll save this as crayon pole. Make sure it's in your playground folder. If you want them all to be the same color, you can color them right now. If you want to color them differently in the assembly, you can wait and do that. Like I said, this is one of the harder videos. You may need to pause this, rewind it, stop it. You may need to ask me to come by and help, but this is one of the last three pieces, just two more slides left, uh, and then we'll start putting things together.